to the Broncos and the Cowboys. I actually think that the Broncos are going to win for once. It's a very, very, very bad stage here, the Broncos. David Fafid is gone. Oh, no. What happened? He's got ankle surgery. Yes, he's, in, he's going to get a surgery on his ankle. That is not going to be good. I actually think that the Broncos are going to win here. The players to watch out for is Hanaso, Fabio Ardito, and Xavier Coates, and Payne Haas. And then, I just think it's going to be a great game. Um, It's going to be a very tough one. It's going to be close. Make sure you put some kicks up there, Carl Felt. Can catch them. Like, yeah. And you can just get the players down there and play the game perfectly. The Gold Coast Titans and the Newcastle Knights. I think that the Knights are going to win here. Kalen Ponga. The player to watch out for is Kalen Ponga. Ponga can get in space. The reason is he does that because of his step. His speed is phenomenal. Watch out for Kalen Ponga. He is going to be really good. And also to watch out for is... I think that Edric Lee can get some good passes from Ponga and go down the sideline. It's going to be a great game. It's going to be a tough one. I think that nice to just get a sneak home. The Rabbitohs and the Roosters. I'm actually picking the Rabbitohs to sneak home here. Very, very close game. But the Rabbitohs are just playing well now. And they just can't lose. So I think that the Rabbitohs are going to win. So... And the player to watch out for is Cody Walker. And Cody Walker can just power for through you. And then, yeah. It's going to be a very close game. And it's going to be a very tough one. So the Bulldogs and the Panthers. I think that the Panthers are going to win here by probably a lot. And it's just going to be... A very flogging game here. Panthers are going to flog the Bulldogs here. Just watch how the Bulldogs are just going to get flogged. <laughs> it's going to be amazing. Watch them. It's going to be the brilliant. Right, and the player to watch out for is... Drum roll, please. Nathan Cleary. He is phenomenal. Great player, Nathan Cleary. He, I think he's going to score this week. And, yeah, just watch the fans swab them. So, the Sharks and the Raiders. I'm picking the Raiders to win here. It's going to be a tight one. Well, the Sharks could go home and take this victory, but I'm picking Raiders to win this. It's going to be a very tough match. The player to watch out for is Sione Katoa and Talakai and Rudolph and, yeah. So, it's going to be a great game. Make sure you watch it because it's going to be a very good one. So, the Tigers and the Eels. I think the Eels are going to win here. The players to watch out for is... Luciano Lelua, Benji Marshall, Mike Acevo, Wonga Blake, Blake Ferguson, Mitchell Moses, and Jai Field. This is going to be a very close one. And when I say very close, I mean it. Both teams are very good. I think that the Eels are going to win this, and yeah. So, Manly and the Warriors. I think that Manly are going to win here. Um, the players to focus on is Daly Cherry Evans and Cody Nikarima. Both players are very good. And Basaka, he, I have never mentioned him. And I just learned about him last week. And he's really good somehow. And I didn't even know about him. So, yeah, I think Pasaka's going to do well again. So, yeah, I think Manly are going to take this victory. And, yep, watch out for Pasaka. So, the Dragons versus the Melbourne Storm. 
I think that the Melbourne Storm are going to win here. The players to watch out for is... Drum roll, please. Matt Dufty. He is so good. And Ryan Pappenhausen. They're both good players. Watch out for them. And I think the Storm are going to win. Good game under our hands. It's going to be a very close one.